Good Thursday morning, a little different looking weather picture for, for us today. We started yesterday, of course, the clouds, but then by this point in the day yesterday, we had begun to see some sun, and then we had tons of sunshine on uh, Wednesday afternoon. Sadly, today, that will not be the, the case. We're going to stay with the clouds uh, through most of the day with eventually, I think, some gaps developing here and there. A few of us will see at least some sun late in the day, but for the most part, a much cloudy day and slightly cooler day uh, is ahead of us. But uh, Overall, still not a bad day. Here's our, our Gwaltly Group camera from Assisi Heights. 57 degrees right now in Rochester as we uh, approach the 9 o'clock hour. Uh, good morning, I'm meteorologist Ted Schmidt. Today, uh, again, looking at 60s instead of 70s for most of us as we enjoy at least a rain-free day. Probably the last completely rain-free day, or at least a day without a rain chance until the middle of next week. It's going to be kind of an unsettled week on going, moving forward. But right, at least right now, a pretty good looking situation. We'll stick with the, the very quiet, peaceful gray weather here uh, for our Thursday with uh, ten temperatures on the way to the upper 60s later on. Right now in the 50s to kick off this morning. The winds are lighter than yesterday too. So, I mean, some things are a little bit better for us, but overall, uh, it's uh, it's kind of nondescript weather, kind of not too bad, not as great, but uh, we're okay here with this Thursday, 57 degrees in Rochester, Winona 59. La Crosse got within a degree of 80 yesterday, it's 60 degrees there right now, and they won't get that close at all today because of the lack of sunshine. 57, meanwhile, in Mason City, the thickest clouds overall today will remain in the southern half of the map. So North Iowa will have the, the worst chance of reaching 70, and we'll put it that way. Uh, they'll, in, in fact, stay in low and mid-60s. Rochester may see a little sun and help us at least get moving to the upper 60s later on. Light southeast winds right now in Rochester, 57, and air pressure is rising as high pressure tries to work its way in for the north. But uh, right now we're dealing with a storm system south of us that is retrograding. In other words, it's kind of working its way against the grain, wobbling back to the north. It's the one that brought heavy rain over the weekend. Uh, we're getting clouds out of that, but no rain today. But look for peaks of sun later on with a brisk southeast breeze around 15 miles per hour, 69. We expect it high. Watch the clouds that they are building in from south to north. Uh, some of those clouds will begin to erode, though, at times. We'll have breaks of sun in the afternoon. Uh, one system to the south down in Kentucky is going to drift northward just a little bit, and they move out to the east over the next 24 hours. The next weather maker for us is coming from the west. That will bring rain for parts of the weekend. Nothing today at future track, but uh, by this time tomorrow, we'll be tracking some shower chances coming from the west that will be mainly impacting our afternoon and evening on Friday. At least light showers here and there with daytime temperatures tomorrow in the low 70s. By the weekend, Weekend. We're talking upper 70s and maybe some 80s, but also some thunderstorm chances. At least a portion of each day features some of those storm chances. But here's Futurecast today, a gray day. A couple of glimpses at the sun in the afternoon. There it is in southeast Minnesota, especially. Uh, so if we're lucky, a nice big gap in the clouds here and there. And we'll enjoy high temperatures around 68, 69 degrees. Here are the showers coming in for the west. Extra clouds tonight. Tomorrow, mostly cloudy skies, some late day and evening showers. A future cast so far, looking at some of this rain arriving after 5 tomorrow. And then some thunder as that center of low pressure gets closer tomorrow night and for the first half of Saturday. Beyond that, for Saturday afternoon, a couple of isolated storms may redevelop, but otherwise, maybe some glimpses at the sun. Now, moving ahead into the weekend time frame, a uh, better chance of more widespread thunderstorms late Sunday. And of course, ahead of that, there's going to be that sunshine. So during the day Sunday, a uh, quick warm-up to near 80 degree warmth, but that may set the stage for maybe some severe storms in the afternoon. Still kind of un uncertain of uh, that weather picture right now. So we'll be watching that closely, but uh, not a huge severe weather chance, but there is that, I guess, stands as the best chance for severe weather over the upcoming holiday weekend, Sunday afternoon and evening. Uh, today for our Thursday, 69 in Rochester, 70 in Winona, 64 in Mesa City, mostly cloudy skies, 69 the high today, 50s tonight, and tomorrow going back to low 70s. Uh, so uh, winds a little bit lighter today with extra clouds, but still overall a fairly pleasant day. Tonight, another mild night, mid 50s, a uh, light breeze out of the southeast. And tomorrow, some showers, especially late in the day. 72 for your sat uh, your Thursday, your Friday. I've got my days of the week wrong. Uh, for your Friday, 72. I keep thinking today's Friday, man. Why not? Uh, Seven-day forecast, showers, a few thunderstorms uh, on Saturday, off and on during the day. That'll be a little bit of a cloudier day. 
Uh, Sunday, it looks like we'll have mainly late afternoon and evening thunderstorms. Close to 80. Uh, earlier, I'd been optimistic thinking maybe that would be our first 80 degree day. It is still possible, but now I think a, a higher risk of uh, some extra clouds give our shower chances there. Even Memorial Day, the first half of the day, impacted by those leftover shower chances. Afternoon looks a little brighter, a little sunnier with 70s, and next week some low 80s by the middle of the week. In the meantime, uh, today, enjoy the, the quiet, peaceful, dry weather today for our Thursday. Get some of that much needed yard work done or whatever you have going on. Uh, we get a break from rain chances. The next few days, not total washouts, but there will be those rain chances coming back for about the next three or four days. In the meantime, have a great uh, Thursday. It is Thursday. And we'll see you back here tomorrow for TGIF.